All right. I got his legs tied up pretty tight to the chair. Help me with his arms before he wakes up or restarts or whatever. We don't want him getting loose. <sighs> He's rebooting. We got you, you robot son of a bitch. Yeah, the cops are on the way. You're going to pay for what you did, you sick freak. Please, what's going on? You know exactly what's been going on. The same thing that's been going on all summer. Yeah, Ted. You're going to act like it hasn't been all over the news that a killer robot has been on the loose and it's been stalking up and down the shoreline murdering innocent teenagers just like us. How could you, Ted? I loved you. I was going to be with you. Are you even programmed to love? Guys, guys, I've been telling you since we got out here to hide out in my dad's cabin that the murderous robot is obviously Devin's new boyfriend, Gleepglorp. What? What? No way! You're insane! Ted, you hate monger. We've been over this. There's absolutely no way Gleepglorp is the murderer. Are you Gleepglorp? No, I am not murdering. I am human. See, he clearly talks with a robot voice. Oh, Ted, Whoa. come on. Yeah. Ted, you bigot. He's from Lithuania. Aren't you Gleepglorp? Computing. Did you mean Lithuania? I'm sorry, Lithuania. Thank you, Gleepglorp. Your English is great, Gleepglorp. Ted, tell me the truth. Are you the killer? Mick said he saw you out here in the garage, hooking some machine up to your body. You robot murderer. Ah, what? No, of course not. I wasn't doing anything. And it, it would be murderous robot or a robot who is murdering. Stop autocorrecting her grammar, you son of a bitch. Ah, okay, okay, I'm sorry. I, did, I didn't mean to. That is a douchey habit of mine, I admit it. But that machine he's all attached to me is just my automatic insulin pump. I have type 1 diabetes. Why? Because the type 2 update hasn't come out yet? Ooh. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get him, Mick. Besides, I also saw you hook up a different machine when you go to bed at night. I have sleep apnea. That machine makes sure my body doesn't stop breathing at night. Oh, weird, Ted. Because we all breathe just fine without the help of our robot friends. I'm not a robot! Locating knives. Locating sharp knives for cutting. What is it, Ted? You're not a robot. You're a cyborg. Is that it? Some kind of bullshit robot technicality? Because you have semi-human features, you're not even well-made. Look at this drippy skin. Ow! Gosh dang it! Now stop! Obviously, Gleep Corp is the robot, and if you don't untie me so we can get out of here, he's gonna kill us all. Look, he's sharpening a knife right now with amazing speed. Who wants human nachos? Oh, I'd kill for some nachos. Yes, kill. It could not be more obvious. I should never have gone out with you, Ted. I've always secretly wanted to be with Gleep Glorp. Hey, I'm with Gleep Glorp, and he's an amazingly consistent lover. Every stroke, just like the last. I will have all of you. I will learn from your insides. Damn, you're the man, Gleep Glorp. I'd kind of like to be with you, too. Okay, uh, all right, where are you going? Don't leave me here. What if the cops can't find this place? It's okay. They'll find him. And if not, he won't starve to death. He's just a robot. Don't leave! Oh, God! You've really gone and bungled the bean this time, Ted. BRB, I forgot something. They suspect nothing, Ted. Cruise. Good. Dispose of their bodies and then come back to untie me. I want to stay like this for a while longer. Oh, and Gleepglorp? You know, I was thinking. I might run for office one day. Very good, Ted Cruz. Ted Cruz. Ted Cruz. <laughs>